the frightening and most difficult thing about being what somebody calls a creative person is that you have absolutely no idea where any of your thoughts come from, really. And especially, you don't have any idea about where they're going to come from tomorrow. Absolutely do not put that commercial in the air. This is the devil's workshop. Get that commercial off the air. People went crazy. Did you see that thing? Oh, by the way, I'll take it. This goes on and on and on and on. I'm getting thousands of phone calls. I want my MTV! I got you. I got you by the balls. That's advertising, baby. I always thought that advertising was the most whorish business a person could get into. Advertising makes food taste better. It makes cars run better. It, 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 it changes the perception of everything. What you can do is manufacture any feeling you want to manufacture, manufacture. I think many times what they're buying is what they wish their lives would be. I guess I understand why people trash advertising, because a lot of advertising is trashy. You can do so much more. There are a lot of people in this business, but damn few really good ones. Creative people rise up. They can't do shit unless we make ads for them. We should be in charge. I hated the system. I hated the status quo. Advertising should be statements about what the hell you think your life should be about. All they cared about is milking money out of clients. How big do you want the logo, sir? You can be more than just a car company, more than just a pet food company. You can speak honestly and use this profession to do that. Weird sh can happen. <laughs> I think creativity can solve anything. Anything, anything. I can get excited about selling a new kind of pen. Wow, what? Look at that pen. Yeah, it's a little this, it's just a little does this. Wow, that sounds like Let me sell that mother.